This is, uh, it's May 1st. It's um, five o'clock in the evening. I uh, have done like, I don't know what you call it, intermittent fasting. It's, you just kind of give your body a period of time where you're not digesting food. And then I got hungry around 4 p.m. And then I started hearing like my stomach growling. So now I'm gonna eat. And I've chosen to get this oriental chicken salad from Applebee's. Here's a bread um, bread stick. I'm gonna let the dog have that. Here, Kara. I'll just put that in her bowl. That's just a carbohydrate, and it's not really nutritional. It's white bread, so I'll just get rid of that. I think the one of the things, you know, of diet, even if you're not dieting to lose weight, just what your diet, what you're eating is, does it nourish your body? Does it, uh, you know, like an apple has some nourishment, but a cookie doesn't kind of thing. Okay, so the salad's really big. It's oriental chicken. It's lettuce. It's cabbage. And they have really thin sliced almonds. Uh, I, I can't remember off the top of my head, but I know almonds are a good nutritional food. Part of my nursing was to take a class in nutrition. And almonds, like if you have a serving of them, like however many that is, 17 almonds or, you know, eight almonds a day, it's, it provides something for you. So there is chicken on this. It's um, breaded and so I'm just gonna kind of put the chicken over here. And then you see the almonds, the little slivers and then I'm just gonna put, eyeball about half of this salad into my plate. And these things too, I don't know what these are, they're little shredded like Asian noodles. But the thing that I love about this salad is the crunch. Between the little noodles, the almonds, and then all the vegetables, has the most delicious texture and uh, there's cabbage lettuce carrots and it's something that I really enjoy and I get off on eating it I like seeing it smelling it I like everything about it now I did order two dressings so that I can have um, the other portion later today sure after I eat this much I mean that's a whole plate of food that's going to fill my tummy way up and then I'll just put this in here and I'll probably eat again in a couple three hours I don't know um, but I don't really overeat I've never been a person that keeps eating after I'm full when I'm eating a plate of food at a restaurant or something and my brain gets that signal like I'm no longer hungry anymore. I lose interest in my food. When I'm not hungry, I don't want to eat. It would actually be like counter counterproductive because it would make me feel sick. I understand some people say they don't ever feel that way. They never feel the hunger thing shut off. Um, so there's my salad. I did order two of these. I think dressing uh, has a lot of calories in it. There's probably four or five hundred calories just in the dressing. So it's a oriental vinaigrette. It's kind of sweet, it's super delicious. I'm just going to pour that on there. And then, like I said, I've got an extra one for the second portion and then this little container can actually be used again 
So I'm just going to put that in the sink, wash that out, and use that later. And so Cara's got her dinner. Mommy's got her dinner. And we're off to a good start for May 1st. Gathering place.